Hey guys, it's Necromancer here, and welcome back to the first video so far. Now, I have changed my name from Body Fang to Necromancer, and we have started a new season of the realm. Plus, this time I'm playing on PC now. So, as you can see, this is all in RTX. This is without RTX. So I got myself a RTX capable PC. And we have started the new season. And there's basically three realms that have merged together and we will be playing as one. We already have started playing like I believe last week. Uh, I haven't recorded from the start because it still took me a bit to set up all the recording software, um, I have to learn e editing software now because I'm very used to the PlayStation one. Overall the quality of video should improve FPS wise and quality wise I think. So what I've done so far on this realm is we, we have basically factions and my faction is Necromancia. And I'm the leader of it. Well, it, it's it's more of like a everyone gets to be part of the decisions and everything. So it's not necessary that I command everything. Uh, we have basically started camp on this mountain because of the new 1.18 gen world generation, as you can see. And I also have this kind of mod thing that's basically like optifying and zoom. I can zoom in. It is very helpful. So, like, this is my current state of what I have actually. I've gotten myself the diamond armor quite recently as we have a secret trading hall, which uh, was made with the help of Grant. Well, that was mostly him, I just de decorated it so far. Uh, we have another portal. I believe a few people already went to the end and have elytras and shulkers, but we will do that in an episode because already Waffle has offer offered me some of them, but I like to stay in out of depth because that I, I have been 100 diamonds in depth then and I have uh, not a single diamond to my name except the three diamonds which I use to craft this pickaxe and the armor was gotten from trades. And also, in the texture pack that I'm using is from Vanilla Tweaks. I just chose what I want. There's this neat, uh, there's this neat feature. I have to turn up RTX for it for it to work though, and it is this. This is the single best thing I've ever found. <laughs> it is truly epic. But yeah, it doesn't work in RTX sadly, but. That's not a big deal. And I love the music from it. It's from the kind of what, what meme. So that's a massive plus. I hope the microphone sounds okay because I am using not my headset microphone anymore, but a webcam microphone. I think it might sound the same or better. And I'm pretty sure it also pick up some, picks up my keyboard sounds quite a bit as it is right next to my keyboard, but I'll be making myself a uh, microphone arm sooner or later so I, I can be closer to my face and it can be overall not picking up so many keyboard sounds as you might be able to hear now. I have myself a stacker home, Not nothing fancy, and on the realm we have a few add-ons. One of which is one player sleep, which is an essential when having about 35 players in the player base and having like 10 people online at the same time can cause some problems. And the other one is mob heads and mini blocks. So I've gotten myself that and we have a diamond mini block and this stuff glows. I believe Super J Dog has got himself two heads also on his roof. 
Oh, sweet. Got to see myself. We did struggle. Oh wow, he has way more heads than I thought. And so this cool thing that he made with the, that he done with this floor is he hid uh, uh, amethyst blocks on under the carpet, so it makes the cool sounds, which is quite a cool thing. And RTX just looks amazing. I still can't get in enough of it, even though I've been playing with it for over a over about two weeks now. And we have a few other people in the faction, one of which is Cosmo Soup. And he started working on his base, but I believe he went away from for the weekend, so I think he'll finish most of this um, during the week. I think he has some sort of like kind of tower planned for it. And we will have this whole place will be turned into a sort of kingdom style thing because I like medieval and most of us can build medieval. So I'm planning maybe to have a, like a giant wall around the whole thing. There's also a second mountain up in that direction. I, I have just like a leaf bridge uh, just and this appears into the distance there. That will be quite a large task as the bridge is about I think one and a half stacks of blocks. So about 90, some, 90, 90 something blocks in that direction. So that may take a while because I actually want to make it look nice instead of just like a straight bridge. So that will take probably a bit. On here we also have a kind of spectator mode add on thing. I don't know if the items required, you need a single diamond and an iron ingot for it. Basically, you can have kind of spectator mode where you can fly and you can't do anything to the world. And with that, you can make truly amazing tanapses, which is a very good thing and should improve this drast the quality of videos drastically instead of just having the camera stand in one singular spot. I also have a texture pack so that it makes the rain unobstructed because it gets annoying, especially with RTX and just drops FPS. I am running a 360 in case anyone wants to know, and I average around uh, 60 FPS in the rain and then about 90 in norm without rain. Uh, I'll put the uh, specs. Uh, I'll English words. I'll put the specs of my uh, PC down in the description if anyone wants to know it. And also, when you need to share the heads, you can sit on them. That's pretty cool. And I also have a cape, which is visible to actually everyone that plays, which is another neat feature. We gotta sleep here. It basically fast forwards to um, to day daytime uh, for a and anyone else that's less, like outside and not in bed. It's just the moon just goes across the sky super fast. So that's a, I suppose, plus, because for the first, uh, I believe, two or three days without having one pair of sleep, it was impossible not to, like, die during the night. I am a little bit, bit behind on the progression, because I only got diamond armor today, and I believe someone's already in netherite, which is quite a s large step. Oh, hello, donkey. Hey, donkey. Which is quite a large step, but that will all come in time. We also have a giant sheep pen. I actually kill a few of them to try maybe get a sheep head, because that would be cool. Plus, food. Even though I mostly live on wheat. I don't think I. Oh! We got a brown sheep head. I didn't really mean to kill that purple sheep, though. But we can always dye them. And soon. With the new biomes, certain mountains are filled with certain types of flowers, which there is a ton of. And we have about, I think, like a stack of. Like, we have nearly a stack in here. And this chest is like stack, stack. There's a bunch in some other chests somewhere. So that's full of random stuff. 
I'm yet to see a wandering trader yet this season, but that's the way that you actually get the mini blocks. Then the heads are the same chances as if you had the Java add-on from Hermitcraft. So like a and you can also do weird stuff like this where you can put one head onto another. And you can also have a quite a neat thing where if you get a mini glass block, I should just showcase it for the sake of this video. Uh, so B F F F F no, not for that, I guess. F and B and glass spawn egg. I'll delete this after. You can have pretty cool dis display cases where it looks like the head is inside of the it's actually a slightly inside and then you can also like let's say you want to have a head head collection like this will work perfectly because it's flush with the top I think you are um, you, it's also possible to get um, dragon heads and I'm not sure do they look like the actual dragon head or do they look like um, like a kind of shortened down version Actually, we can check that right now. F and B. Huh. I don't think there's actually one for the dragon. Which is a bit weird. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's one for the elder guardians. So I'm not sure, is that like shrunk down or is that like the full size head? This it might, and it might not. Let's just actually chuck this away, so there's no cheating. Hold on, I think I had some bow somewhere. Or did I? I'm not sure, did I? Just chuck it and it'll just despawn. This will be it for this video, this will be just like a, no a notification episode of what's going on so far. And in the next episode I think I will get started on the main builds slash base, like this is only a starter home. I have planned out a second kind of house there, and, we, and, we, and I might start planning out the rest of the homes around it. And I'm not sure on either this mountain or the mountain over we'll have the main kind of castle build. Of course we will be building in kind of medieval slash fantasy style, it should look quite nice. But I think this will be it. So this is Necromancer and I'm out.